Welcome back to Games for Everybody. I'm your host, Matt. Playing some Strong Beds cool game for attractive people, so let's go visit Perducci at the club. Perducci! Well, well, well! If it isn't dangerous, get his little green sidekick, Ronaldo! We've been expecting you, haven't we, killing you guy? I'm the Huntsman! I understand that I have something you want! The plans to the kidnapper's secret hideout! So just hand it over and nobody has to get hurt! Except everybody that's not me! Not so fast! I'm willing to turn over these important architectural documents to you if you can best me in a gentleman's game of cards! Fine! What's your game, pure dookie? Five card, hold them, 52 pickup? Rock, paper, baccarat! Uh, of course! Being a sophisticated worldly traveler, I'm intimately familiar with the game of rocks, papers, and Bert Bacharach. But Ronaldo here is an uncouth roustabout, so you better explain the rules. For him. The rules are simple. Each player is dealt two cards. You first, then me. Choose your best card and play it on the table. The player with the best card wins. Oh, and nothing beats rock. Except paper. I'll give you a minute to decide if you want to chicken out. If not, let me know when you're ready. All right, so a little bit about this. Um, so Perducci, as you can probably guess, is the king of town. Uh, but he's wearing dark sunglasses, a brown bowler hat, and like uh, an old-fashioned 1930s like pinstripe suit, uh, navy blue. And killing you guy is strong mad. And the only difference with him is that his unit his unitard says "killing you guy" on the front of it. And uh, he's got post-it notes of like scars and stuff on his face. Uh, so I'm in Club Techno Chocolate. Some of the uh, tables have been turned over. Uh, there's nothing behind the bar, but there is a picture of a guy with a big knife, like a painting. Let's see what that says. Whoa, that's an awesome painting! Where'd you get it? None of your beeswax! And keep your grubby mitts off of my stuff! All right, well, let's play this card game. Hmm. Shuffle those cards! And I want to see your hands when you do it! Uh, that's gonna be a bit of a problem. King of Town doesn't Fine, have arms either. But no funny stuff! Hmm. Okay, Perchuti, let's play! Let the games begin! Du -du -du. The name of the game is RPB. Two for you and two for me! Let's see, I have a numbered I have a numbered card. It looks like it's from Uno. It's a seven. And then I have a time card. Let's try the seven. Well played, Dangerous. But see if you can beat this! I don't even know what that is. This game makes no sense. Let's just play another card. Beat this! Beat this! The Ace of Spades! That's the best card there is! That's right! I win! Too bad, Danger Dope! Alright, well, so much for that. Let's, uh... Let's head to Venice instead. Wrong oh, bad, you kidding? You can't put Sonar Card Gauge in your movie! That guy is creepy with a capital Cree! And I don't think he's too clear on the whole fantasy reality thing, neither! You're crazy, man! Sonor Card Gauge is awesome! He's perfect for the role of Dad Jurassic. Has he even seen the script? Script? That guy doesn't need a script! He's a natural! Just stand back and watch the... Hey, is that thing recording? No, of course not. Well, here we are. Ah, Venice. 
All right, so we're at that bridge um, with the creek, and there's a cardboard cutout of a guy with one of those uh, little boats that he that goes through the canals. There's a podium. Let's see what's on the podium, and then I'll talk about Senor Cart Gauge. World solidest gold nugget. Solidest? Well, where is it? I want to steal it. All right, so Senor Cart Gauge is strong bad's. Well, one of Strongbad's alter egos. He looks exactly like Strongbad, but he's tall with a uh, beer belly, and he's got a comb over, a goatee, and he wears these like big glasses, and he he's very out there. Like we just got to talk to him. You'll see. Hey, you. Um, hi, Dad. It's me, Dangeresque. I know it's been hey, Brethany. Are you came to fetch the Dodgers? Um, yeah, Dodge. Yeah, you can't dodge me anymore, Dad. There's been a kidnapping and no. The kids are all went to the Malvies. Yes, yes, the old uh, Malvies catacombs. Is that where the kidnapping you were never able to solve went down? I'll do it, Dad! I'll finish the case for you and then you can help me rescue cutesy buttons! If you go to the store, can you buy just me a cheese burgwich? You left me this mysterious trinket before you left, Dad! I have to know! What is it? That's real beautiful, Jennifer. Can I broach it for my prong date? Um, oh, I get it. You can't talk about it now. You never know who might be listening. Alright, so I can go to the catacombs. These catacombs may be elusive to some, but I'll always know just where to find them. Uh, Central Asia? <laughs> I've got a bay here over here feeling about this dangerous. It's spooky and smells like sardines. Dangerous eats spooky for lunch, and sometimes sardines. But only if we're out of fish sticks. You stay here and watch the entrance. This is something I've got to do alone. 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 Alright, so it's it's the King of Town's castle. There's a mural here that looks like, I don't know, it shows different objects like a taco, a bowl of salsa, um, a margarita, a pepper, maybe some, I don't know if that's a thing, a flan. Anyway, a couple of random Mexican food items and a sombrero. And it looks like there's lines drawn from them through the catacombs to the other side, so maybe I can solve it somehow? Could this be a clue? Hey, that looks like the number eight combo meal from El Taco Leches. No, it doesn't. It looks like a clue. One of my dad's clues about the lost kidnapping case. Hmm, yeah, there is nothing. Maybe if I put the trinket here? No way! No. No, I guess let's just go through the catacombs. I have no idea what's going on. Hey, look at that! You opened up that there gateway thingy! This is as far as Dad got! Man, that was easy! I can't believe he went totally nutsoid from one little... Oh. Hmm, there's a puzzle here. Oh, it looks like I moved the tiles. You know, let's go ah, back. Ah, good! The puzzle resets itself if I step away. Very clever. All right, let's go back to where I was. Oh, I got an email. All right, so it looks like... Hmm. Should be... Margarita. Okay, so... No, fr from the top going clockwise... Should be... Definitely... Burrito at... 12 o'clock. Flan at 3 o'clock. Uh, margarita at six and hat at nine. But let's see, what 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 would I do about the taco pepper? Hmm. Let's take a look again at the mural. Could this be a clue? 
Hey, Ed, looks like the number eight combo meal from El Taco Leches. No, it doesn't. It looks like a clue. One of my dad's clues. About right, the so... lost kidnapping case. All right, so bowl of salsa in the upper left. Let's see. It's a good thing I spent all those years studying ancient cave hieroglyphics and Mexican fast food menus, or I'd never be able to solve the deadly catacomb puzzle. All right, so you know I'm gonna write this down. Let's get a notepad document. Come on. Eh, let's just, alright, let's keep going. So, we got burrito, nachos, flan, what next? Gotta follow these lines. Pepper, margarita, taco, sombrero, and bowl of salsa? Bowl of salsa, okay. So let's write this down. Okay, so burrito, nachos, flan. What was the next one I said? Pepper, margarita, uh, taco sombrero, and salsa. So I gotta match the tiles so that they have that same pattern. And then the heart should be in the middle. Okay. So let's do the puzzle. Alright. So I got the burrito. I need the nachos. The flan. The... Pepper. All those years studying ancient cave hieroglyphics and Mexican fast food menus, or I'd never be able to solve the deadly catacomb puzzle. All right, I got it. Ooh, the other half of that trinket. What's that? Roar, I'm a scary monster. Ooh, look at me. I'm gonna bite your head off. Roar, Holy crap! And cheat? What happened? You told me this was gonna look like some kind of giant T-Rex with tentacle arms and laser beam eyes. <laughs> Fix it in post? This is post! Crap! <laughs> <sighs> I better figure this thing out before that thing bites my extremely handsome head off! Alright, so it's just strong sad wearing a motion capture device with the, with the little balls on it. And he's got a socket in the middle of him that looks like a heart. So let's grab that trinket. Uh, come on, almost got it. Almost. Uh, oh. Nope, it's stuck in there. Let's pry it out somehow. Uh, safety scissors. Okay, I put it in there. But it didn't really do anything. Uh, you know, let's put the other one in there. Shut your face! Whoa, this is so awesome! The trinket is merging with that ancient artifact. It's turning into... into... It's a little heart candy. Quiet, punk! The legendary blood-soaked albino griffin prism heart! I'm gonna eat you! Now I'm gonna put the heart and put it on the monster. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Hey, giant Octosaurus! Time for a little heart to heart! No! Oh! <laughs> okay, so a bunch of boxes fell on it, fell on the monster and uh, knocked it out. You, you can see the cheat up at the top of the frame throwing boxes down. All right, let's keep going. Oh, the poop smith is here dressed as a girl. I'm saved. You must be the kidnapped little girl, but you're a beautiful woman now. 
Oh, thanks. Don't talk, baby. It's over now. I'll take this as proof that the case is now closed. And I'll tell my father he was right all along. What the creep jeepers is going on in here? I solved the kidnapping case, Ronaldo. She was kidnapped by a monster with a broken heart. That's the dumbest danger -esque. You're a genius. No, I'm genius-esque. Now let's go tell Dad. Race you there. Well, Dad, you never believed in me, but I did it. I solved the lost kidnapping case that you never could. And I have the proof right here. Oh, thanks for the recyclables, Angela. Thanks will make a pretty good blanketer. Uh, right, Dad. No time to waste. I'll meet you at the kidnapper's hideout once I get the plans. Alright, you know, let's go back to the catacombs real quick. The metal detector was here, so let's take it. This must have been left here ages ago by some poor kidnapped treasure hunter looking for lost doubloons and Sergeant Pepper Oni's Pizza Palace tokens. Alright, where should I go now? Um, you know, let's head back to the club, see what I can do. Or, you know, I could use the metal detector, so let's go to Brainblow City. Let's try it out and see if there's anything that's relevant to the game. anything all right well let's let's talk to bubs in the prison see if there's anything going on with him if there's any way I can find out how to win at that card game if not I'll end the episode I need some info, Diamonicle. I'm your inside man. And eh, nothing. If I need any more info, I'll be back. You know where to find me. At least for the next five to ten. Alright, well that's the end of the episode then. So we'll play cards in the next episode.